to welcome you to the Ask Jeff YouTube channel. Here's today's question. When you, quote, give something to God, do you literally hand it over to God and do absolutely nothing except maybe pray about it? Do you have an active role when you give something over to God? If you have an active role, how do you do it? That's a great question because we talk about giving something over to God. Uh, as a parent, there has to be this point where we give our children uh, over to God per 1 Samuel 1, Hannah and Samuel and all that scenario. Or maybe we have an addiction that we need to, quote, hand over to God. And I think one of the falsities is saying, okay, God, it's all yours. And we just throw our hands up in the air and act as if the enemy will never use it to tempt us again or there's never going to be a struggle or it's just, it's washed away, so to speak. If we have a struggle, a temptation, addiction that we give over to God, Understand that whatever that struggle is, we don't need to find ourselves in an environment that would enhance it. Or if we do, we need to do like James chapter 4 says, we need to, quote, flee from it. Oftentimes with our children and relationships, difficult employers, bosses, supervisors that we've just got to hand over to God, we may still be subjected to difficult situations, tense situations, but we're trusting that God will give us what we need, uh, not just to embrace it, but to navigate that scenario. So I think it's really a both and. Giving to God is this heartfelt, God, I'm placing you in control of this. I, I can no longer fight this fight, i.e. Zechariah chapter 14. But at the same time, realize that as we go forward in it, there may be times that we have to remove ourselves from a situation, reject a situation, embrace a situation, or simply just trust God that even though I've handed it over to you, this doesn't make sense. Why is this still happening around me? It's just trusting him in the, quote, process of him doing what only he can do in whatever situation that we've given over to him. Now, Lastly, before I close, there are some things that we physically can hand over. What I mean by that is you may have seen or experienced in these old time revivals of days gone by that people who struggled with different temptations literally brought the bottles of alcohol, the packages of cigarettes, and they quote, put it at the altar. Again, there's a physical expression there, but again, it goes back to you're desiring not to have it as a part of your life anymore. That's an active role that I am throwing it away. I'm getting rid of it. I'm going to quit watching it, whatever it may be, and then providing an environment where it cannot be easily accessible. Great question. If you have one, send it to askjeff.net. Maybe your question will be tomorrow's. Thanks for being a part of today's daily question. Now, we answer a question each and every day. Please feel free to submit a new question at askjeff.net. Net. We may not have gotten to yours today, but we eventually will continue to be a part of this. Subscribe so you don't miss out on Question Every Day.